All right, everybody. Come in and sit down fast. This game is coming in hot. <laughs> the train is leaving. You know, the train is leaving the motherfucking station. <laughs> we have 45 minutes for our one-hour creative game panel. This seems like a really poor decision. <laughs> No, I mean the whole thing. Yeah. The whole panel seems you know, like a really important decision. They can't all be winners. No. Mike Selinger. We, we really have to start. Yeah, yeah. absolutely <laughs> the case. Yeah. All right, so uh, obviously I am Jerry Holkins, a.k.a. Tycho Brahe of Penny Arcade slash fame. Uh, this is my best friend, Mike Rahulik, a.k.a. Gabriel. Um, in, if this was like a jazz thing, I would say that he was on the keys yes. or something like that. But right now, he is currently drawing for your amusement. Um, the other part of this situation uh, is Mike Selinger and his hand-selected group of oh, yeah. game design groups um, yes. here for your entertainment this evening. Now, Mike Selinger, can you introduce your crew for me, please? I'll be happy to. Um, so, uh, uh, this was a terrible idea. Right, um, right, agreed. Uh, totally, wholeheartedly, yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, but, uh, yeah, are we, uh, can the guys actually get in through that crowd? I hope so. Well, they're still gonna, out there? They're still out there, yeah, there's still people filing in. Um, so you might be doing the entire game solo. Oh, no, 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 I wouldn't do that, man. I, I, I need a lifeline. I need to throw, throw this people. Well, why don't we talk about what game we're gonna do while we're waiting for these guys to get in? Sure, sure. Yeah, let's start figuring that out. That's exactly. like a really good idea. No, great so, idea, guys. This so, is the... When I used to talk to, I used to talk to Jeff Cowles. Right now, Jeff Cowles is the producer of the Acquisitions Incorporated shows, yes. um, which you can feast on this evening. Um, but before he was doing that, he was making games on phones, and then before he was doing that, he was working at Nintendo. And he said that people would always come to him with designs, say, hey, we got the idea for the next great Mario game, just give us your Mario IP, yeah. and we'll go crazy on it. That's how that works. Exactly. And Nintendo said, that, no, that's not how it works. You need to bring us a game that is fun, even if it is just white circles jumping on squares. White circles jumping. White circles jumping on squares against a white background. It still has to be entertaining and fun. Then and only then can you have our Donkey Kong. <laughs> right? Tell me that this leads us somewhere. Uh, it leads to, uh, I think that it would be very inspiring for Mike if you could just get over there and just put together some cool mechanics. Yeah, no, no problem. <laughs> just on the table uh, for our entertainment. Um, well, we need a theme. I mean, like, you can't, okay, so. What am I going to draw? Seriously. <laughs> exactly. so, all right. All right, so, so, uh, uh, when we put this idea together, it was like, yeah. it was like, oh, this is a this is a train. This is gonna be a train wreck. Exactly. Right? So, so are you and saying I'm you want to make a game about right wrecking trains? Should we make a game about train wrecks? Yeah. No, I'm gonna draw trains. <laughs> 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 no, see, this is the problem with designers. <laughs> you can't draw engineers. Okay. No, you can. The train wreck can be the inspiration, but you have to make them something not trains. Like they have to be aliens, or they have to be something that I'm gonna draw. You don't know how to draw trains? Were you never five? I can draw a train. Hey, no, hold on. Now, is is drawing the train better if it has a little face on it, like Thomas? Yeah. <laughs> Angry train. Oh, she's a vampire train. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Mike We're not doing trains. We are too. You're no. drawing a badass one. No, woo woo. No, trains. Train wrecks can inspire you, but I need something more than trains. <laughs> well, why don't you come up with an idea? <laughs> you know, you're I was just brought here to draw. All right, all right, all right, all right. We're gonna need some help. All right, all right. What what should we make a game about? Sandwiches? Sandwich. Rip search? Sandwiches. That's the, going. that's the best you got. Alien alien pornography. Alien pornography. Alien pornography. We're waiting for you to approve something. Oh, we're waiting on me? Keep going. Okay, keep firing up. Come on. Sandwiches! Stop saying sandwiches. Okay. Sandwiches sounds pretty good. Yeah, yeah, different kinds sandwiches? of sandwiches? Different yeah. kinds of sandwiches? 
Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. No. I like sandwiches. I also like alien pornography. No. Is there a way that we can make sandwiches filled with alien pornography? You know, I, I can't stop you from making sandwiches filled with alien pornography. No, I mean, what if what if Subway existed on Carzax 5? Yeah, seriously. You want to do this? I think we can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's totally rich mechanically. Absolutely. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you so, guys still blocking the entrance? Why aren't you all in here? <laughs> Come love us. Come into our love zone. All right. Well, uh, all right. I'm I'm on board with this thing. I got alien sandwiches. Yeah. And with well, alien intelligent sandwiches. intelligent sandwiches. You can yes. decide whether they're aliens or whatever, right? But you are you are responsible for the sandwich art. Well, it might be you're the thing. sandwich artist. Yeah. Yeah, you're totally a sandwich artist. Think of this as a step up in life. They, they evolved on a planet where instead of mammals, it was sandwiches. That's sure. right. No, no, they came into prominence. That's right. Yes. So, first, this first sandwich, no, the first uh, Asiago loaf crawled from the primordial ooze. Yeah. And it just it put the entire planet on a different trajectory. All right. So now are, are you getting... Oh, yeah, I love it. Uh, uh, hey, enforcers, up by the front door, can my crew get in yet? <laughs> yes? No? No, they're here. They just are blocked by the mass of humanity. By the way, that's you, the mass of humanity. Uh, by the way, that's an awesome name for a band. Mass of humanity. Mass of humanity is totally like they. I. I, I that might be. That'll be our next game. Yeah, seriously. Our next game will about be uh, entering into a panel. Okay. All right. Well, I need my I need my crew in here. So enforcers, get them through the other door. There's a second door. <laughs> <laughs> this is much harder without game designers. <laughs> Alright, so let me explain. Uh, yes. I, I'll do this part. So, um, uh, uh, Lone Shark Games, little team of game designers who make Pathfinder Adventure Card Game, who make all sorts of games. Yeah, you can applaud. Um, so, uh, so, um, uh, it's a crew. We live downstairs from Penny Arcade in some sort of dungeon. It's true. They, they... No, no, it wasn't a dungeon at first, but then they brought in like a sacrificial <laughs> dais. Yeah, we made a dungeon. Yeah. Um, so, uh, so yeah. So I'm gonna introduce you to our guys as soon as they can get in here. Um, waiting for a cue from an enforcer. Come on, guys. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, okay, you and me, we're story, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Story. All right, what is the story of the sandwich universe? Okay, so, do we wanna, do we wanna, it's like this, this is Don't give me do we wanna, that is not how this works. Oh, you uh, throw something down and we keep it. All right. <laughs> Sandwiches growing and evolving for dominance. For dominance, so they're in struggle with each That's other. That's right, they're in a struggle with each other for flavor, right? texture. Okay, hold on, this is good. Flavor, texture, got it. Okay, I need a pen. Oh, yeah, I got a pen right here. Okay, Oh yeah, hot, hot and versus cold. cold. Okay, right. Great. Panino, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, hot versus cold. What else? What else? Yeah. You got flavor. Flavor. Nutrition. Nutrition. Burritos. Right. Right. Burritos are expansion. You can't have that now. Yeah, no. The burritos. Uh, okay, wait, wait. So everybody, look over here. Look what's coming in the room. Okay. So uh, this is our game design closet. This is all the stuff we use to make games. Right, so over here, let me introduce the guys. You wave your hands when I introduce you. I can't see you. So uh, over here we got Chad Brown. Uh, Chad's the lead, lead developer on Pathfinder. Um, we got Liz Spain. She's the designer of Incredible Expeditions. Woo uh, you got Elisa Teague. She's the designer of Geek Out. Woo you got Gabby Weidling, our puzzle ninja. Nice. Right, and uh, we got Paul Peterson, the designer of Smash Up and Guillotine. Oh yeah, wow. Yeah. This is a rock star crew, so you should be very happy they're here. They are now going to make a game for you live. Let me tell you what has happened, because you guys do not know. All right, sit down at this table, put all your stuff together. We are making a game about sandwiches in an alien universe. Yes, yeah, sandwiches. Con right. Conscious. Here, I'll, I'll, I can bring it sandwiches down. inspire you. Indeed. So yes. Note the art, right? right? So, no, imagine the universe. Oh, please. I have an important question. Is it taco a sandwich? No, tacos we've determined, like burritos, are part of the expansion product. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you can't do that. Uh, so, uh, so, 
Exactly. We've got a battle over uh, they're establishing dominance. That's right. So right. We're talking about a world where sandwiches crawled out from the primordial ooze right. and not mammals. Right. Right. Uh, they, they can. Uh, there can be uh, various uh, factions. They can be like. What? They're fighting burgers. They're fighting burgers. Well, no, I think they're fighting burgers like the fighting Illini or the fighting Irish. Right. Right? Like it's, it's their team name. It's their clan. It's their clan, right? So, uh, so uh, uh, you can have hot versus cold sandwiches, McDLT style. Yeah. Right? Put it uh, together at the time of consumption. At the time of consumption. Uh, you got uh, battles over flavor, over nutrients. All right. So um, the sandwiches can evolve, right? Because remember, they're living beasts. Right. So Jerry, you might want to bring the mic over to them. Oh, I will. I don't think they got one. Um, so, uh, so guys, what kind of tools are you going to use? Yeah, sure. 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 So, because, so demystify this process, or maintain the amount of mystery that's interesting to you. What tools are you going to leverage to create this game space where sandwiches live and breed for dominance? So Liz says hard. Hold on, but Jer Jerry, you have the microphone. You have one too. Oh good, okay. Yeah. All right, so Liz says cards because I love card games, but we also do have glitter turtles that can be sandwiched together. Nice. Glitter turtles? Glitter turtles, yeah. Is that a genre? Them. No, it's like just like a kid's toy, and I wanted them for games, so I bought them. Yeah, right. that's how that's how games happen. Apple into everything. Yeah, games happen that way. So uh, what else we got? We got boards. We got we got dice. We got. T tell me some of the stuff you think we need. No, you have to understand. Mike Selinker of Lone Chart Games. Yes. They are already running over. This is like some um, Iron Chef type. Yeah, yeah, they got 30 seconds to go to the kitchen. No, they are. Right? Uh, no, I see that someone has got some red snapper. Nice. Um, I see some shiitake mushrooms. <laughs> Can you let me know what they need in terms of art? Absolutely. I will. I'm going to act as the membrane tissue that sends these signals across. Okay, but don't die. There's no. Do we think these aliens live in a capitalist universe or a communist? Food? Literally a food. Wait. Food tokens. What does food eat? <laughs> no, my, you understand, so as, as, the, as the holder of the IP... <laughs> oh, I see, I see. We're already in a copyright battle. Now you understand. If you want to see how games are really made, motherfuckers? It's like the WWE. Alright, no. Go check with the license yeah, So there's no... To our, to our conception, thank you very much, Michael. But that C, wait, that, wait. that C is a magical sigil that means we're going to make a lot of money off of their toys. Give me a name, give me a name, give me a name. Oh, a uh, sandwichio. Yeah. No, give me a good thing. Oh, <laughs> a sandwichian. Sandoval. What? <laughs> Sandy. Sand what? Sandy. Just put a Y in your gun. Sandy. The sandwich. Okay. <laughs> what kind of game are we making, guys? Oh, I'm I'm so not you. You're done talking. Yeah. Uh, what? Uh, to my talented game design friend, what kind of game are we making? We're we making a board game, a card game, what? No, I didn't ask you people. You're not a professional. Shut up. I don't have time for you. You are not involved in this panel. Um, they came up with sandwiches, man. They actually did a great job. That's actually right. So what, what kind of game are we making? Yeah, it's on. All right, so we're clearly making a Euro Ameri Ameritrash hybrid uh, with uh, resource gathering and a card-based uh, building mechanic. You're just firing out words from board, board game geek. You just listed the entire category tree. So um, you start as a piece of bread and you're trying to evolve best alien sandwich race you can by gathering different resources. We have uh, carrots, we have chicken. Oh, there are pieces of bread right here. Yeah, Fish. There's, one, there's one piece of gold in this. No, Why no, no. is there? <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're, we're working out the details right now. Oh, so we don't need this bread? No, we have bread. No, we have bread. We have bread, but we need the, what, 
Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe these could be gold cards with like. Yeah, that's what I think. Wait, what did, what did you say, Paul? Oh, oh you're Paul, what did you say? Gold? Okay, no, no. Here, gold you... cards? Here, say, tell me more about these gold cards. Uh, gold, gold cards, where you have. Everybody, gold. Yeah, yeah, everybody has a goal on a card that they're trying to get the pieces to make that kind of sandwich. Oh, sure. It's a so sandwich hidden, building game. Hidden information aspect. Is that how evolution works? Yes, exactly. So basically, uh, mammals evolved by going, I would like armor plating, and they pulled it off the store shelves? Is that, is that basically how that works? It, it succeeded, right? Yeah, no, we out. We still know about this piece? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Armadillo's a strong IP. Meat, cheese, vegetables. Meat, cheese, vegetables. Oh, are these, uh, what are those? It looks like they, it looks like they dumped a bag of friskies out. <laughs> <laughs> I, love it. I love it when something is pulled out of our game design cabinet I've never seen before. <laughs> All right. All right, this is already going Jerry. wrong. Yeah. All right. yeah, yeah. Okay, what do you got? All right, here. So remember, remember game design crew that this is an alien universe. So it is okay to incorporate things that are not traditionally considered sandwich items. Oh, okay. I, so I would say, I would say hours. Okay, so I need... Alright, I need somebody to volunteer to be on the faction team. Which of you is, which of you is gonna be on my story, on my story team? Story team? Yeah. Oh, I'm already in mechanics, man. I'm already I kind of design factions for a living, so... Alright, Paul, get over here. Alright, faction team has okay. been you established. Paul's yeah. coming up here. You, three of us are going to give Mike some direction. Yep. Okay. Okay. Angry, angry, cookie. Here you go. Grab this. Okay. Yeah, pull it. Here's some doodles so far. Do, do you normally just put them all on top of each other no. so that we can't yeah, see? Yeah, I like this guy. Okay. With the butter knife. Okay, so, uh, Paul's game is Smash Up, so you know he's, he's real good at making factions happen, that's, right? That's okay. right. So, alright. So, Jerry, come on in. Yeah, I'm here. Okay, okay, so we need, we need uh, some sides. We need to give like. Wait, so you mean like um, potato salad? No, 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 no. no that's, that's, a, that's a good idea. <laughs> that's like a good idea. This isn't the time for that. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. So we need like four four factions that can fight each other. Okay, panini. Panini. All oh right. yeah, yeah, right. bread. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So grilled bread, firm, crisp crust. Uh, they have sort of an Italian look to them. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. They have they have those those that's delicious racist, lines. Isn't it? No. <laughs> There's nothing racist about that. No, no, no. Okay, so all right, so so that's one. I don't think you can say they have sort of an Italian look to them without it being racist. <laughs> all right, go, keep going. <laughs> Are you the one who's interrupting them? <laughs> okay, got it. Okay, yeah. wraps. Wraps. Oh, oh wraps. yeah, wraps. Okay, okay you know what? Burritos were out. Yeah. A, a wrap is basically just a cold burrito. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, wraps is good. I like that. Right. Okay. They're kind of like they're kind of the new agey kind. Yeah. How, and how about a biscuit witch? Oh, oh, biscuit, which like the like uh, the uh, like a McDonald's for exactly, breakfast. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, it's okay. All right. So now we need. Okay. So uh, subs. 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 Okay. Which of these is the good guys? Which of these is the bad guys? Do we have good and evil in our sandwich oh, universe? Let's let's have let's have like a hierarchy of a, of sandwich alignment. Right? Sandwich alignment. What? what? The world is not black and white. <laughs> the world is not black and white. <laughs> Yes. World, world wraps is not black and white. Yeah, right. yeah, that's right. So, all right. So, uh, but I mean, there's like, is there, is there? Well, a... so the paninis though, they're like, they've been transformed. They aren't just bread anymore. Like no. they've gone through, they've gone through fire. That's exactly oh, right. they, maybe, oh, it's an elemental thing. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Cool. Cool. All it's right. It's a right. trial. So, so yes, panini yes. represents fire. Right. right. And the okay, wrap is cold. The wrap is cold. So that's that's wa water. Yeah, it's water. Water. Okay. So. Um, uh, br uh, the biscuits are fluffy, so they're air, air. right? Right. Optimally, uh, a biscuit is very fluffy. Yeah. yeah well, what, 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 what was the vegetarian remake? sandwiches are earth. That's right. No, we don't have no vegetarian sandwiches. <laughs> we have to be careful. No, no. no. <laughs> but the sub. We have to be. We have to be careful. Liz is over there. Something gluten free is coming in. Oh no, we gotta. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. yeah right, right. Liz, we need a gluten free Here. option. Yes. Yes. And so the sub is the earth. Sub is the earth. The substrate. The yes. substrate. Oh, yes, sure, sure. The substrate. Okay. Now, uh, do we have like? Okay. Can, can you guys hear me? Should we have the sandwiches fight? Oh yeah, they're fighting. Oh, yeah. yeah, absolutely. That's not even a question yet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Definitely, definitely. Okay, so which of them? Uh, uh, so we, we have our factions. That's right. right. That's all good. Do they have? Do we want to give them names? I love the substrate. That's awesome. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm all about that. Um, let's see. Here, I'll work on the names. Okay, you're, you guys okay. work on the systems. 
Okay. Okay, you're good? Okay, yeah, so you're yeah. gonna go back over? Okay, I'm gonna go back over. Okay, cool. Tag him. All right. So, uh, this, you're seeing the game design process live. So, uh, we're currently in the design phase. We'll be switching to the development phase very soon. That means all good ideas are out the window. We won't have any more ideas. But, um... But uh, we will just lock things down. What do you got there? I'm, I'm going to... You're going to storyboard? Exactly. I'm going to create the names, okay. and then I can talk to... And once he has a name, I bet drawing the character will be yeah, easy. I need right. Oh, uh, absolutely. Okay, so you, you guys are going to take on the story. Here, do you want to take this with you over there? Yeah, absolutely. So I'm thinking once... Oh, yeah. Do you have something already? Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm getting to it. Yeah, you, 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 two, you two store it up. I'm going to go yep, over yep. and check on the design. On it. I got it. Okay, what's going on over here? This kid looks good. It'll be funny yeah, so, right? right? Yeah. Uh, so we have sandwich recipes. Okay, sandwich recipes. That uh, vary according to faction. That's what, I was, that's what I thought you were. Sandwich. Meant. Upgrading by adding meats and space dolphins. Space dolphins. Like I need a meat to paint each one on like a meat. Oh, we're done that. We're done the biscuit. Noodles. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Once you complete all of your recipe, you get some sort of superpower that is uh, particular to your type of sandwich. Oh, uh, okay. Um, you get, I'm sorry, you get some sort of superpower? Well, yeah, yeah. Haven't okay. you met space sandwiches? I, I haven't. I came over here to meet them. Oh. Uh, Salutations. Salutations from the Space Sandwiches. Okay, so what, uh, so what components are you using? So for this, yeah. So we have meats, <laughs> we have space dolphins, right. we have moon cheese, yeah. we have veggies, we have bread, and we have noodles. Bread is not a line? No. Bread for anybody can get bread. Oh, anyone can get bread. Obviously, it's blue. Some, but some only need one piece of bread if it's an open face. Yeah. Like the yeah, the wraps. Oh, I see. Okay, so there's different resource management. Got it. Got yeah. it. Okay. Um, We're going to need the heating element too. Definitely going to I have an update from the story team. Please, uh, go right ahead. Yeah. The biscuit witch yeah. is now the biscuit witch. Oh, the witch is. Oh, nice. Nice. Yep. There are six resources. There's six resources. I've got you six. Oh, I'll get you a spinner. No, no problem. I'll give you a spinner. No, it's good. I got one already. It's a roulette wheel. No, no, no. It's totally a roulette wheel. No! Do you need an actual spinner? We would like a spinner with six or seven pieces. Great. What? You know what we have for that? A paper cutter. Why don't you build one? Just six it up. Just six it up. Okay. So the dog is bad. Where is the number three? Collect resources. Wait, you can make custom dice like this little, uh... We have, wait, we have folding tables? Yeah, we have paper. You can, use, yes. you can also use dice land dice if you want to use those. The paper could be the same Yeah. Yeah, and these are just... Lisa, are you on the tech team now? I'm on the deck. Uh, you just need dice? Oh, no. Oh, wait, we're good. Okay. Oh. Okay, what's going on here? Each faction has a set of recipes. Yeah. And what, what are you making? What are you drawing? Uh, I'm working on the biscuit witch. So oh, nice. That's very Final Fantasy VII. I love yeah. it. Yeah, uh, it kind of opens up and then she's tucked away inside it like VV, right? Yeah, that's good. That's good. So most of the time it just looks like a hat. Right now, just, I want you to see what Elisa's doing. Um, Elisa is building a spinner from scratch. No, she's making a D8. Sorry, she's making a D8 from scratch? Yeah. Oh, out of Dice Land Dice. Yeah. Yeah, of course. You need blank dice land dice any time you're going to make a game. Yeah, well, yes. Do you have any stickers? Do we have any stickers? I wasn't in charge of this. We have glitter turtles. We have glitter turtles. We have glitter turtles. We have glitter turtles. I'm sorry, what are you using glitter turtles? Oh, we don't need stickers. Screw that. We can make a guy. We have pens and we can make a guy. We'll do it. Okay. Do we have paper? Paper? Yeah. Paper designers don't use paper. We have construction paper and a yellow line. Alright. So you guys are almost done with the design step, right? Yeah. We're getting there. We're, we're about I mean, to we're do the development of playtesting. Really? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. What am I doing? Yeah. No, no, so here we go. Just everybody pick one of the factions. Veggies. And make three different recipes for it. What right. are the factions? Oh, I'm going to... The factions are... Oh, I was actually starting to tell. The factions are subs, paninis, uh, wraps, and biscuit sandwiches. No bagels? No. Oh, no bagels. Did you, you said no bagels. Yeah. Expansion. 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 There's only four elements in the world. Okay. What were they again? Again? Subs, paninis, wraps, and biscuit sandwiches. Biscuit sandwiches. Alright. Breakfast Yeah, breakfast sandwiches. Breakfast sandwiches. Okay. You want breakfast? Sure. 
Okay, Gabby's taking breakfast sandwich. What are you taking? What are you taking, Paul? We're wrapped with my idea. I'll take breakfast. Okay, Paul takes subs. So, so Liz, you're taking paninis? I got the paninis. You got the paninis. All right. Possibly the least gluten-free of the bunch. Yeah. <laughs> Is there something left? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Do we want this to be a number or do we want this to be a number? Are you? Are you? Yeah. I guess. So. What are you designing on the die? Uh, you will put a thing again. Oh, okay. All right, cool. The the highlight the I know that you have a board on the table, a blank board. Are you using the board? Not yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. figure it out. It's happening. Uh-huh. Oh. Great. By the way, when your game designer says, when you're asked, is this a board game, are you using the board, and you say, I don't know, maybe, you're not done. That's a clear indication the game is not finished. I need, I need to know how she interacts with, like, how does she fight? Does she fight with a weapon? Does she fight with her hands? Like, oh, sorry. Okay, I need a weapons team. I need somebody to switch over to weapons. Gabby, you're on weapons. Come on up. 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 Uh, Gabby, this is like the flavor text phase. <gasps> I love that phase. Don't you love it when we haven't actually finished the game design and we start the flavor text phase? It's the best. All right, so uh, Mike needs to know what kind of weapons these things use. Oh, what kind of weapons okay. these sandwiches use. All right, so he's right now drawing the biscuit witch, which is a witch. I like it. All right. All right. Um, yeah. What? Gravy gun. Gravy gun. Gravy gun. Gravy gun. That's good. Gravy gun. Gravy gun is good, Mike. What was that? Hot oh, Reese. Here, no, hold on a second. Think about this. Mike, what if she had a wand that was made from those, like, little toothpicks that would have the club sandwich thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it just has a little foil and felt as a little yeah, tub yeah. on the top. Yeah, I buy that. That's, that's good game. Anyway, it, it's literally something you put into sandwiches. Yeah. Right. And in fact, what else could you do? What else could you do with those but fight? Yeah, it's the only thing. Yeah. Actually, uh, you know, a lot of sandwiches uh, in, in, in restaurants up here come with like actual little swords. Right, yeah. little, little plastic swords. Right. Yeah, little, little, little cutlasses, like little pirates. cutlasses, yeah. right? So maybe that's the panini's weapon. Yeah, right? panini's, panini's nice. cutlasses. What? Club. Club sandwiches. Nice. Okay, one of them's got to have a club. That's the uh, that's the earth one, maybe the sub. Uh, the Earth one, there was a famous Mongolian general named uh, Sabotai. Oh, Sabotai. So he's like sort of the military strategist of sandwiches. I love it. Excellent. Does he have the club? Uh, he, he, he can have a, a club. Let's go, let's okay, go with that, him okay. the club. There's your club sandwich joke. Uh, uh, what other kinds do we have? We have a... Uh, what, what, panini. Panini and got, wrap. What do we need for oh, wrap? Oh, what do the wraps use? Wrap! They use I know, wrap like they have a wrap bag! They have a wrap bag! Exactly. I'm so glad we were right there. That's right. No, no, this is something called low hanging fruit, and I will admit that there's 45 minutes here, yeah. but I'm not grabbing that fruit. <laughs> okay, let me show you the relationship between a game designer and an artist now. <laughs> I'm sorry, we're on deadline. Draw the fucking fruit. <laughs> oh, oh, a rebellion has occurred. <laughs> I'm gonna win that game every time. <laughs> did, you say, did you say fucking fruit? Yeah, no, that's actually something else, isn't it? Um, okay, so, so... We got the wraps. No, what, okay. Right. Did we come up with an answer for the wraps? I think wrap is good, but I mean... Yeah. I'm not gonna do it. Alright, right, what else we got? Wraps. Cool. Yeah. Wraps. Somebody give us an idea. Pickle spears. 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 Alright, good. Okay. Mike, do you have enough information to work from? I'm good. Okay. That's what we want. Butter pickle spears. Butter not that delicious. Are you nah, being, son. I love that we feel that we need to give him that much direction. Yeah. Uh, pepper, spray? pepper spray? No, 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 no. Too soon. Too soon. Okay. Butter knife! Butter knife? No, no, no. Well, this nah. is not a universe where cutlery has evolved. Right. Right? That's a, total, that's a totally different battle. <laughs> what? No, we're gonna go with cutlasses. Let's go. Alright, all right. you're done with happens to Go back to work. Condiments. Oh, I like that. Mustard gas. Mustard gas. Yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe that's what stands in your way, guys. Is all the, the, the environment is littered with dangerous condiments. Yeah, what, if, what, if they're, what if they're environmental? Yeah, this might be how we do our ketchup mechanic. <laughs> you villain! You fail, Wondering 
I don't know. I thought it was like that. Was like, <laughs> banana gun. No, I totally got banana gun. The actual banana. Okay. Uh, step me back in. Do this. Oh, so there's an element. Random. We need like a heating element. You need a heating element. We need a heating element. What? What? We need a heating element. These are sandwiches. The panini. Well, screw the panini. How about extra lemon? Screw the panini is heat for heat. I don't think you understand how this universe works. I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get the continuity team on this. Uh, okay, story team. I need a critical, critical question. Yeah, yeah, fire away. Do they do the paninis need an exterior source of heat, or do they generate their own internal temperature? <laughs> so, 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 hang on, so would, would we be talking about something factional, like that, that, that they factional requires, yeah. different from other people? Yeah. I think, that, I think that maybe they need heat to be at their best. I see, all right, all right. All right, so you can use, maybe, maybe use a mechanic where uh, each of them has a different, different, uh, different outside requirement. Are we being asked? Yeah, yeah, no, no. So I was trying to answer your heat question, right? Yeah. So, so maybe each each of these factions needs a different outside requirement, right? So like, like, what? Elemental Yeah, elements, they each need an element, right? They need their element. It's not that they are the fire element, they need the element. They have to have it, yeah. Right. Sure, sure. so the, the, the breakfast, breakfast sandwich needs to be elevated by air, it needs to rise, it needs to expand. Don't look at me that way. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe that's where we put, maybe that's where we put the element in. Every, every single one of them. All right. Element. 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 Pick an element. Okay. All right. Where, where's our element? Elisa has modified, just to be clear, Elisa has modified her design of the die in die. Yeah. That's not how you design games well, either. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just each of yours has an element. Like, breakfast element okay. is added. Okay. Right, so Mike and Rulik, mm. I have two more. The other, the other characters so have the panini. They're emphasized, they're epitomized by Captain Panino. Okay. Captain Panino. Captain Panino, a pirate. He's got the, the plastic cutlass. And the rap is Queen Frasch. Okay. So ima imagine that, imagine that the top, imagine the top of the rap opening in that way that a French queen's Victorian dress would open. At the top. Okay. Right? You hold on, wait till I end up with the witch here. Okay. I was just about to do like I mean, we could use one for our cooking elements. But he said, um, she has to just arrive. Yeah, that is supposed to know who you create a guy. You want, what are you using the Vinci stones for? No, we don't need elements. Okay. Elements. 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 I like how Elisa has become the kitchen. <laughs> oh, really? It sounds like you spend... Okay. So you gotta be done your recipe and if you what, want to... What are you drawing? Well, you, you said that the biscuit witch has to rise. Yes. And you were inspired and by so that? So, this is her using her air power. She's rising up, right? <laughs> Alright, so let me run your run your entire story. You, you, you've now spent months on your story development. That's exactly right. Right? So run the whole thing for me. It's very rich. Oh, it's in terms of that. In terms of that. Yeah, who are the characters? characters? Right. And obviously, you know, we can release more characters. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is expandable. Right. So Subs is a Subutai, a sort of a general type character, the Biscuit Witch. The Air Faction, very mystical, ethereal. Um, Captain Vino has that has that uh, that uh, piracy nautical aspect that kids are banging begging for. Um, and Queen Queen Frasch is sort of a regal, tasteful execution of the rap style. Think of like a Caesar rap. Excellent. All right. Okay. What does the winner get? What does it mean to win this? Yeah, no, real time rolling. Real time rolling. Yeah. Real time really? Yeah. What? Real time you mean rolling? like roll as in roll a die or roll as in? You roll a die, roll like, oh, I got a one, I got red. I can put red on my thing. Ooh. Then you build them up, then you go boom. Do you only have one die? It's so beautiful. Each player only has one. It's so beautiful. Each player. Now make, now now make, make more. more. Now make me four more. Yes. Now make three more. That's a lot of the <laughs> 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 okay. The dog should have elements on it. Are we really doing this? Yes, we're really doing okay, this. Okay, well, we can use the pieces. Oh, yeah, we could use the pieces. I like your thing. That's what real-time dice. Yeah, we'll do Real-time dice is awesome. Sure. We well, used to make it a genre. No. No. Real-time dice, Steve? No. Space is 
queens on the phone they want to talk to you about. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we invented the genre in this room. Yeah. Uh, who, who here is going to object? Okay. Um, yeah, right. Fine. <laughs> anyway, um, so what is on this dial? Um, all of our ingredients. Bread. Noodles. Noodles. Space <laughs> salt. Mungie. Nice. Veggies. Did she say noodles? Choose one. <laughs> noodles, of course. And your element. Oh, okay, cool. So Space you roll, you roll the element, and then you have to take someone else's stuff. And then you have to take someone no, else's stuff. What you guys are designing? <laughs> are. I'm just saying two different designs. Okay, you should choose the one. We're fighting. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. Right. You are representing the internal struggle of the sandwiches. Yes. Stop it. Okay, got it. No, I like this idea. I like this idea. Yeah. I like this idea. It would be really fast. Can we really get an intern? You need an intern? For I, need, I need three more copies of this guy. Oh, sure. Yeah, absolutely. We can put three more copies of this guy. Intern! You really want this? Wait, tell me whether you really want this. Yes. Okay, great. Right. I need to, I, I'm going to do some job interviews. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we're going to have a very serious... Uh, I need two more... Two more... Uh, Get up here. You, come here. Okay. Alright, so this is, this is a window into the game design process. I mean, choosing your team is very important. You do deep, uh, deep and analytical job interviews, right? So I'm going to ask you guys some questions. Ready? Do you have hands? Okay, you're hired. Congratulations. What will you your game? Elisa. What if you just fall away and say, Elisa, stop designing games. What? Sit up. Never. Okay, so uh, I want to introduce you to your interns. Okay. You're now working for her. Whatever she tells you to do, that's what you do. Alright, what are your names? I don't have time for your name. Okay, so, uh, so Elisa, put your people to work. Yeah, like the other thing. Yeah. Just like eating. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Yeah
sandwich into the bowl. Yeah, we'll win us and all. You pick your best sandwich. This is just a three-way tag team sandwich battle. Does that sound good? A three-way tag team sandwich battle. Sandwich all day. All day. So you pick your best sandwich. Oh, that's right. Whoever gets the highest reward. Oh, I see. Right. Total. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Gets to take a bite out of each. Yeah. Making fast sandwich bags like bald and soggy. Yeah. So you're trying to. Those are modifier cards. Those are extensions. Yeah, seriously, man. We don't have time. We don't have time for your time to be good. Although I would start working on that right now. Okay, great. We do have time for it. Okay, looks like the series gives it. Gabby. Gabby obviously has advantage, but she rolls like crap, so... Yeah, Gabby, 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 Gabby always rolls wrong. We call it Gabby. So, like, uh, you don't want to roll one on a die, it's no fault. Okay, Gabby, tell me what's on your card. Well, this is the Brenner breakfast sandwich. It's a bread, a couple veggies, a couple cheese, a space dolphin, and a noodle. Okay. And then uh, we have the double decker for the hangry alien. <laughs> Good use of hangry. Hangry. Uh, two bread and meat, some cheese, some noodles, and the fast track of dawn for the lazy alien. Uh, the bread and the meat, the cheese. This game contains the words fast track of dawn. You don't need three notes. I don't need it. It's just number three. That's all. Gotcha. Okay. Guys, if that's not what they use the glitter turtles. You didn't use the glitter turtles. We'll be okay. We'll use those as markers later. Yeah. Okay. There's not a lot of later, by the way. No, I know. <laughs> later is not a thing we do on this We're going to be stepping on the next game. No, no, stop, stop. Oh. So, we, we each add up. We fight for three spots. We fight for four spots. We fight for one. Both okay. the number of dice that they do made. Like, if I made three threes, I'm only three dice. Everybody, we're fighting for threes. All right. Mm -hmm. And you guys have the highest roll wins. Three, 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 yeah, that's a lot of sandwiches. I was thinking you just, you just go for one sandwich and then... How's it going on the art side? Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, you so might not be going to find my seat. Like, you may not be able to build the five. Because that's the really Okay, cool. I like that. <laughs> you guys are seeing this wizardry down here? Okay. Yeah, so we'll do it one. We'll have really fast. Yeah, it's great because I'm going to put them on the spot in about 30 seconds, and they're going to have to be done. Yeah, we're done. We're done. We're done. Okay, great. Play testing. Play test phase. Play test phase? Yeah. Okay, play test phase over. <laughs> Did you guys enjoy the play test phase? Which of you is going to be the design team leader? <laughs> tell me, one of you is going to be the design team leader and tell me what this game is about. Oh, excellent. I'll do it. All right, awesome. Right. Liz has just been promoted. Okay, the business development team just objected to Liz's promotion. Apparently there's a salary issue. Uh, it's just a title game. Okay, but do I have at least budget for new business cards? Yeah, maybe. Okay, I have a, okay, I have business cards. Nice. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. Okay, fine. Uh, uh, all right, Liz, stand up. All right. Okay, Liz, I want you to walk me through step by step this game. All right, so meet your maker. Yep. All right, we're on our alien planet. Each person picks <coughs> one faction of sandwiches. Uh, for example, panini, the sandwich wraps, etc. You get three cards. The three cards have the sandwich recipe. As soon as you get your three cards and it's all time, we have a timer. We haven't yet played test to what that timer should be. Maybe it's a minute. Never been to do it. Maybe 30 seconds. We'll go, we'll, we'll go with a minute. Let's start with it. We have a minute to roll a glorious uh, custom D8, which is our being made by our lovely interns over here. Woo! And each time you roll an ingredient on that die, you get to pick it up and put it in a pile. Once the time is over, you have to build your sandwich. As well as you can. At the end of filming the sandwiches, everybody throws their sandwich into a mega ball. Mega ball? Yeah, okay. yeah a mega ball. You roll the number of dice equal to the ingredients you have on your sandwich. Highest roll wins, all the other sandwiches are defeated, depleted, and gone, and you win that round. Repeat. <laughs> That's going cool. All right, awesome. Here's your new, here's your new uh, de de design. Yeah, the, Business card for this. Yeah, it's been uh, it's been, 
Yep, so we, 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 don't, we don't skip steps here. Uh, all right, so now we've finished the game design. Exactly. We're, 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 we're checking on the art department. Yep. Oh, you're still, you're still doing cover? All right, doing cover? <laughs> all right, still, still doing cover. Great. All right, all right, so are you ready? now go for the box copy. Are you ready? Yeah. On the world of delicatessen, <laughs> we eat your breakfast. Crawl from a sea of lukewarm mayonnaise into the heat of a thousand heat lamps. And if you can't take the heat, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Meet your maker, two to four players, 10 to 20 minutes, ages 10 and up. Mike, tell me what you're doing. Uh, this is the biscuit witch hovering on her uh, elemental power of air. I also did a, I think it's final treatment for the logo. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> Keep going, everyone. Right? Yeah. yeah. And she's uh, she's magically you can tell her eyes up. Oh, nice, nice. All right, okay, great. Okay, so last step uh, in any game development process, now that we've made the game, the box copy, the cover, is the release to the public. Okay? So we, uh, we're we going to take all this. Um, uh, would you buy this game? Yeah! All right. What? <laughs> Wait, you have a problem? No, no, I'm waiting to hear what you say. No, no, I just wanted to find out. We did our market testing. That's exactly right. Uh, okay. We did our market testing. We released to the public. That happened, by the way. You now own a, own a copy. Uh, congratulations. Uh, and uh, so, what did you think? Did we manage to make a game in an hour? Thank you very much for coming out and being part of it. So, Team, why would you know how to play? I don't it's know. not relevant. Uh, so, uh, once again, Jerry Hawkins, Mike Rohoa, Liz Payne, Gabby Wyman, Chad Brown, Paul Peterson, Lisa T. Some nameless and irrelevant interns. I'm Mike Sager. Thank you very much. Anybody who wants to come and take a look at the game? What? Okay. What are we doing right now? How would you know? Woo! Lou will probably end up in the final, so I'll just make it look at the